Hello guys, Wahoo here, back with another video, this time around guiding you through the new Pride Month event that we got going on in Trove right now, if you can see right here, as here from today and all the way to the June 26th, we are going to have 14 days of the uh, Splinted Summer event that we are going to call, also known as the Pride Month event that we got going on in Trove right now. I do also want to say that we do have the, uh, you know, 14 days of, uh, you know, gathering or today, then do some fails tomorrow and all that stuff and also again friendly reminder to do them on saturdays to do one dungeon and get that double xp potion we still got the other event going on as well uh, as still uh, i'm just going to show you that is the salt trash the one that's cleaning up the oceans and stuff like that for the next I would say about uh, three weeks we got it still. It's the whole month. It's until July 5th or 4th or something like that. I think it's 4th. Um, but, it, of course, it will show up uh, right here on here when that actually is going to be over. So, uh, after June June uh, 26th, it's going to be go back to that one. But, uh, of course, the, the uh, event is going on at the same time. So, if you don't know what that event is, I will link it in the description if you want to check that one out as well if you haven't seen that one but the two events is going on at the same time and they can be done uh, simultaneously I, I think uh, I did the other one uh, some while back you know of course when I did the other one but you can do two events right now if you want to do so one for the clean up the oceans hashtag team seas right and then also of course from the pride one as well which we are doing on today as well so we got seven steps of these ones and again you also got the 14 days of doing uh, random things uh, as we are used to for the 14 days of an event so not much more to say that but uh, let's jump into uh, step number one all right, so for step number one, we have to go to the Trove Hub, and we got the monorail is back for the year, uh, and you can ride it around as long as you actually want. I love this rail, but you do have to go in a specific way, because if you actually, you can see right here, if you go uh, this way here, you are going to go down to Cubesley, as we will right there, but if you take it this way around, as you can see, I'm just going to take it right here, you can see, doo, you're going to jump over here, and then you're going to go just around and around forever and you can just celebrate all the pride that you want to go here another one is joining me and as you can see is just keep going and going and going but we are going the other way right now we are going to go down to mr cubesley right down here you can see he is going to be right here so for step number one all you have to do is go to the hub and you're going to, it's going to interact with the grand uh, marshal cubesley as you can see here and all you do is you do is that and here you can see all the new some of the new stuff that is in uh this one is locked i'm pretty sure because you need to collect all the other things to do this one i think that's some of the new stuff that they um added so you kind of have to unlock all the other things to unlock this one so you can't just unlock this one they wanted you to participate in some more and you can see this is some of the old stuff uh you can still pick all this stuff up here and there's also one right here that was the first year we had it so uh, yes this is the third year we are having all this but i'm pretty sure that's why uh, you can probably see here um yes it's so the sale the other sale the sale yes okay so all the sales you have to unlock all these sales we can up to five of these so i'm pretty sure these are tradable pretty sure this one is not tradable i think this is an ally oh it's a costume this is the costume for the uh, the tomb raiser that, that's pretty awesome there's another cool this one is really cool as well a lot of people talk about this one uh, or ask me about this one the, um, the the dino tamer one that we got last year that's really awesome as well so really enjoy getting that one as well and there's some cool uh, stuff in this one as well especially the banner but yeah you can get the you know the dino tamer costume as of right here and i'm definitely also getting the uh, pineapple here <laughs> uh no the pinomancer uh the tomb racer skin here as well because i think these are just absolutely i love the color scheme of all of these the colors is just amazing uh but also i've got to get all the skin all the you know these ones and probably maybe some more you can sell them some of them uh, i think you can just you just have to buy them i don't know if you have to learn them uh, i don't know about that but uh, you can first then buy my suggestion is that you buy all of them and then have them all in your inventory and then see if it unlocks make sure that you uh, refresh uh usually by leaving it and then opening it up again because it won't uh, usually it doesn't work like that where it has to update first so also if it doesn't work you can also relock one time try to see if that works if it doesn't work if it doesn't unlock and then if that doesn't do it I would assume that you have to uh, you know 
learn them all and then you know this will unlock again it will only unlock when you have opened all you know reopened it again it has to update before it's so it is usually how it definitely uh, works but uh yeah this is what you do for step number one pretty cool uh so just wanted to put in some little extra information there in step number one but let's quickly go on to step number two all right, so for step number two, all we have to do is go to our claims. Uh, I have it on L. Uh, you can also hit it down here. You can hit it by your mouse or whatever. Uh, but whatever you have it on, you have to collect these ones as well. Uh, this one is a little amount that we have right now. That's just because it's uh, it's a top loot. It's a new loot uh, thing that is in here. It's nothing to do with that. I uh, just wanted to mention that before someone's like, well, what is that? Well, uh, it's, a, it's a personal Ferris wheel. I actually don't know what it looks like. I could... Uh, check it out real quick for you guys now that I'm actually mentioning it and I shouldn't go there I should go here and we're gonna equip it and this is what it looks like it's all cool uh, it I would oh it has popcorn on the back is that popcorn or what is it <laughs> I'm not sure but uh, for step number two all we have to do is just uh, go to our claims and claim these Valor coins and then go to Cubesley again. And the only thing you can buy here uh, is this one. You don't have to do that. You can just go out there, farm some coins at three star dungeons, which we are gonna do uh, in you know some of the other steps basically. But uh, for the sake of the video, I'm just gonna go ahead and buy this one here. And that's gonna complete it. You don't even actually have to, yeah, it's, it's tradable. Uh, you don't actually have to learn it. You can actually just sell this one if you do choose to do so. Uh, I don't know what it goes for right now. It's probably just gonna be uh, worth kind of a lot right now. Uh, it's not. Uh, it's not. <laughs> it's not worth a lot. Uh, but it's also pretty easy to get this one, and you can basically get all of them. I'm pretty sure. If you'd rather just buy them off the marketplace, you can do so, and then you can probably unlock this one without doing all that. We don't know what the price is this one either. So yeah. But anyways, we are gonna. I'm gonna learn it because I do want my ten mastery. But. Uh, that was step number two. Now we can move on to step number three. All right, so for step number three, we have to defeat five of the three star dungeons. Uh, I'm not sure if they actually do work in, you know, Geo top side where you have those five star dungeons because those are actually technically two three star dungeons. So uh, I would just suggest you kind of go and do it. Uh, sorry, I was hitting the wrong button. Just go to you know, you 10, you 11, whatever you or you can do, and you can go and do uh, some some dungeons right there. It should work right there. I don't see why not, but uh, I'm not sure if it do work. As you can see here, uh, it defeated it right there, and you also get some valor coins, of course, out of that. But you have to do three, oh sorry, five three star dungeons. And again, I'm not sure if it do do work in Geo top side. If it doesn't, well, there's not really a big deal. You should just go to, you know, regular world and just do your five star, uh, the five, three star dungeons right there. So I'm going to get my last four done and I'll see you guys in step uh, number four because this was step number three. All right, so for step number four, we have to return to Kuzli in the hub. So we are going to do that. And we also gonna look right here and that's gonna complete it. Uh, you actually can collect a few of these. So I'm gonna go ahead and buy one of these. I am gonna go with the pineapple one. I'm gonna get the pineapple one and I'm still gonna learn it because I do want the mastery. It's only 10 mastery, but I do like it to uh, do that one. So that was a step number four. All you have to do is just interact with cubes. You don't have to buy anything or anything like that uh, so you can buy more of these if you want to but I'm gonna save it and get all of these and also kind of cool that you actually can see how many you actually bought because then I know four I bought these two because there's only four left and then I can just go for these ones as well if I accidentally bought more of them it doesn't really matter you, you can sell them on that but yeah I'm gonna get all of that so uh, with that said that was a step number four we can head into step number five all right, so for step number five, we are right as we are right here. And all you have to do is jump. As you can see, whoop, it went up two, three, four, five, and six. And that's going to complete step number five. Not very much to it other than the six jumps you have to do here for step number five. So not going to make a big deal out of it. Just jump six times. I know, crazy, right? I know, crazy, crazy. But uh, that's going to complete step number uh, five. And we can now head into step number six. All right, so for step number six, we have to do 25, yes, 25 three-star dungeons. So yeah, 
If the trick does work with the Geo top side, I would really recommend you guys going there instead and doing that because then every time you find a five star dungeon or just a regular three star dungeon, but if you find those five star dungeons, it counts for two of them. So I really hope that really works for you guys. Uh, if it does, you know, let me know in the comments if it do work and help out some other people. Uh, but other than that, I would just suggest you just go on your daily, uh, you know, adventures. And then you could just do these 25 whenever you come across them. And maybe if you usually don't do many three-star dungeons, I usually don't do that many of them. But now I'm actually going to do so if I get past some of them just by doing my daily stuff. But I am going to do my 25 ones right now. And I'll show you guys all of them or some of them uh, right here. Alright, so for step number uh, seven, uh, you probably saw me doing step number six, but this is step number seven. You have to just defeat enemies. You have to do 78, 78 enemies. It can be random ones if you probably go to some skull dungeons. You're going to do them pretty quickly, but it's just enemies around. So I checked that with doing uh, one right here. So I'm not going to do this one in, you know, because it's just killing some enemies and you already saw me doing all the 25 dungeons took some time but you can see right here this is the new costume that is for it it basically is very much pineapple-y uh, the banner behind me is of course when one we looked at very first this one right here uh, as you can buy more of these if you do want to you can buy more of these as well actually you see that and actually put them up on the marketplace if you want to do that that's also the same thing with this one but I, I bought it for the 30 right here and uh, so I'm gonna get the last of these other ones so I can unlock the cruiser but yeah this is what it looks like and this is the pineapples as you can see uh, these are my minions my pineapple minions and the big one uh, the bigger one is just looking like a, a lot uh, more of a pineapple guy like a really crazy pineapple guy <laughs> he really wants that a pineapple and of course um, you know as the you know ultimate uh, or not the ultimate sorry at the the wraith there uh, it looks very cool I really kind of like it. it would look like more like this one I'm not a biggest fan of this one costume compared to the one we got from uh, sorry the dino tamer which of course is here I like this one uh, quite much more than the last one here as uh, yeah it kind of looks I feel like it looks looks better I know I don't have the right VFX uh, either for the Tomb Raider right here I'm using the old ones as still but I still kind of like the other one uh, better I do like the Wraith here that looks very cool I wish they all were skeletons um, uh, you know being like skeletons instead of being uh, you know 
pineapples, but you know, kind of look for the still funny with the the pineapples and having a big pineapple uh, scary guy. But yeah, this is what it looks like. Uh, so yeah, very cool indeed. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed uh, the uh, guide. I hope you found it very cool and all that stuff and helpful. At least that's what I really. Oh, that's a really big. <laughs> it's really really scary. <laughs> it really really is scary when you get it. Like really huge. Like uh, that guy has it. Really huge. Oh my god. Okay, that is scary. <laughs> Maybe it's not that bad as I thought it was. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Take care. Enjoy. And hope, again, we have two events going on right now. You should get uh, both of them done. So anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.